We've all dreamed of the perfect getaway. We've saved hundreds or even thousands of dollars to make this a reality. And the last thing we need for this dream vacation is to be scammed. In this video, we'll list down five of the most popular defrauding schemes that target tourists. Number 5. Stain on your shirt Nothing beats donning your best OOTD on your dream vacation. After all, you're going to Instagram-worthy places. But what if someone suddenly spills drinks or stains your shirt? More often than not, it's an accident and the person responsible will offer to clean your shirt for you. But think twice. Some scammers might use that opportunity to pick your pockets or take your luggage away. Stains on your OOTD is bad enough. But spending the rest of your vacation in the exact same clothes is worse. So stay alert. Number 4. The Free Bracelet Most of us like freebies, but there's one thing you might need to watch out for. The free bracelet scam. The fraudsters are usually locals, often using women and children to keep your guard down. They'd force you to take their bracelets when you finally give in. They'd make a scene and demand for payment. And that's not all. An accomplice might be waiting for the opportunity to take your belongings if you get too caught up in the commotion. Number 3. The Bag Slash Imagine yourself walking down a busy street, having the time of your life in a foreign land. There's lots of people to meet, places to go and experiences to cherish. But once you reach out for your wallet, you get a big surprise. Your bag or your pocket has been slashed open. And just like that, you're left penniless in a sea of strangers who might not be able to speak your language. How do you call for help then? Number 2. Fake Wi-Fi Hubs Beware of fake Wi-Fi hubs. Some of these free connections are legit, others not so much. Hackers could use free networks just to steal personal information, like passwords and credit card pins, so connect at your own risk. Unless you're willing to pay for a more private data connection, I suggest you should think before you click. Number 1. Flirtatious Local Women There's nothing more captivating for tourists than the close scrutiny of locals who take interest in them when they're in a foreign land. More often than not, they just want to meet new people and have some nice meals together. Some could ask for more favours, but nothing really tops those who want to take your money without your knowledge. They could take you to a bar or a hotel room with free-flowing booze to get you drunk. The next day, you find yourself empty-handed and alone without a single centavo in your pocket. Don't be afraid to meet the locals, though. The bad ones are usually isolated cases, but it pays to be more aware of their motives. Thank you for watching. Can you think of anything else that could be included in this list? Let us know in the comment section. Remember to like this video and subscribe for more daily content. We also have a website you can check out at www.neoxide.com.